If time's tables for you Are difficult to do It's time for you to start A multiplication chart Come on, listen to me A multiplication chart can help you remember your times tables. We've already filled in the times tables from 2 to 6. Let's complete the 7 times table. We can start by filling in the blank boxes in the 7th column. 7 times 1 is 7. The next 5 boxes are already filled in from when we did the other times tables so there's less and less new information that needs to be filled in. 7 times 7 is 49. 7 times 8 is 56. 7 times 9 is 63. 7 times 10 is 70. We can also complete the 7th row. 1 times 7 is 7. The next six boxes are already filled in, which makes our job easy. Let's say we couldn't remember what's meant to go in the other blank boxes. Well, we know 8 times 7 gives the same answer as 7 times 8. 56. So we can transfer that information over. Similarly, 9 times 7 equals 7 times 9, 63. So we can fill that box in as well. Finally, 10 times 7 equals 7 times 10, 70. So we can fill in the final box in the 7th row.